We just saw a wild orangutan. Today is a really exciting day. We're in Sandakan. We just took a bus yesterday from Kota Kinabalu. It was about seven hours and it was pretty comfortable. But we are heading out to the jungle today. We're going to Kinabatangan River Sanctuary where we're hoping to see a load of wild wildlife. If we're lucky, we'll see wild orangutan, but I think we'll have to be very lucky to see that. But there's loads of other wildlife along the river. We're going on, I think, three different river cruises and hopefully a trek through the jungle if the rain holds off. So we're really excited about the next couple of days. Before we get to the Kinabatangan River, we have to take a four hour bus. So we're gonna go and get that now. I think it's waiting for us outside. Rob, yes. yes. This is snazzy, we get a whole pickup truck to ourselves, I think. I wasn't expecting this. No, it's quite posh. That's They've got our luggage in the back and uh, yeah, got the tunes going. Hopefully it should be quite comfortable. I know the road can be a bit bumpy up there and it's rainy season, so. We made it to our place, it was about three hours in the car. It was quite comfortable. It was a bit sad, we noticed like a lot of palm plantations the whole way along and you just know that the reason that they're there is because they've cut down all of the rainforest around. We are now at our homestay, we've checked in. We are the only people here. The only other people here is the family of the people who own the place, which is quite a lot of people and we've got about an hour now to basically just relax. I've been a little bit miserable today, which is why I haven't really been on the camera, because it's been raining and the rain really affects my mood. But it's stopped raining now and we're heading out on the river on our first cruise. And I do love animals and I hope we get to see some. Oh wow. Yeah, it's filming. So unbelievably, about 10 minutes into our boat trip, we just saw a wild orangutan building Making its nest. nest in, I didn't even know they lived in nests, but they build nests every day. Yeah. Oh yeah, it must be on this tree, yeah. Oh, yeah. some butterflies flying around. Basically we're seeing a whole lot more than we actually even really expected. We thought it was going to be raining a lot, it hasn't rained yet, thankfully, and we've seen some great wildlife already. I'm very happy. I've, I was definitely a bit grumpy on it, but now I'm very happy. We've seen something I did not expect to see. Robustus monkeys are very cool. It's very, very ugly animals. Um, so we're having a really lovely cruise and it has started to rain a tiny bit. I've got my jacket and I'm not complaining. Such a nice first boat out. It was amazing we got to see orangutans, loads of proboscis monkeys, loads of other monkeys, um, a couple of hornbills. We've got two more boat rides to go. Hopefully it doesn't rain for either of those two as well. 
and we have good luck and we can see a lot of other things on those rides. delicious. I've been distracted by the huge TV the whole time I have to say but food is really really good. We had fish for dinner, spinach, potato, rice and watermelon pudding so I'm very full and very happy. In the evening we went out in the boat again and it was awesome. We saw loads of cool stuff. We saw two different types of kingfisher like a sort of baby looking one and then a big one with like a much larger beak. Uh, we saw some different monkeys, we saw some proboscis monkeys and some long tail macaques which was really cool. We saw this cave that was full of what we thought were bats but they were actually a kind Swiftlet. of... Yes, yeah, Swiftlet or like you said. And that was really really cool, they were all like gathered there together and it's quite unusual to see that except from at night time. It's definitely a lot different to the daytime kind of safari because it's... Yeah. Um, you don't see the same sort of things like you don't see the crocodiles and the birds and stuff as much in the daytime but in the night time they're kind of easier to spot which is quite cool. It's now what half past nine at night? And we have one final boat cruise in the morning at 6am so we're going to try and get as much sleep as we possibly can before tomorrow. It's five o'clock in the morning. Conversation got boring. We just had to get up early. We've got our boat cruise today. It's our morning one. And we're both a bit tired because we didn't get in until 10 p.m. last night and then we had to get to sleep. But we're really excited to get out again on the water. I don't know what we'll see in the morning. It'll be light now, so hopefully we'll see some more monkeys. If we're lucky, we'll see an orangutan again. Um, but we're just basically just going to go out and enjoy and see whatever we can see. It's really misty today and really beautiful. There's no one out. The river's really, really still. So I'm hoping it'll be quiet and we can be able to keep see some nice wildlife. I see the bags in their eyes. It's definitely still too early for me to be getting out there to see the harness. How you feeling, Jenny? I'm starting to warm up slightly now. It was a bit cold and a bit wet out there. It was before breakfast, before sunrise I had to get up. And then it was raining and it was cold. So now I'm wrapped up in all the blankets in the room to try and warm up again. It's only just 8.30. We haven't had breakfast yet. The boat ride was really good. Um, it was raining for quite a lot of it. We saw some interesting birds, but um, my overriding feeling was being cold and wet, <laughs> I have to be honest. And a lot of the things were a lot further away, so it was quite hard to film them. Um, and to see them through the binoculars kept on getting completely like covered in water, so... It was nice to really get out there again, and I think if the weather had been a bit nicer, we would have felt even more positive about it. I think that we were lucky that it only rained like that this one time because it is rainy season yeah. and if it rained all three times we went out on the boat it would have been very upsetting but we were lucky we got to see lots of the other times that we went out. We're now just going to wait for breakfast time, they're going to call us for breakfast. I really need coffee. We need coffee and then we'll be going on our jungle trek later so we're hoping it's stopped raining now, we're hoping the rain carries on, not falling 
so that we can get out and stay dry because it won't be very enjoyable sludging through the mud. We got back from our jungle trek and then we kind of got distracted by lunch and then the kind of family band that are playing in the kitchen we ended up watching them for ages so we didn't come back and debrief but the jungle trek was really good it was about two hours um it was quite sludgy muddy and wet yes um and he showed us quite a few different like plants and showed us some orangutan nests at one point and like some weird gross insects and stuff yeah. kept picking them up and being like you want to hold it and we're like no <laughs> but unfortunately we didn't see any like monkeys or any birds or anything which we were we hoping saw, to yeah see. we saw some monkeys right at the end when we were actually coming back through the palm oil plantations because they eat the palm oil fruits but that was the only time i think because it was so sludgy and wet we were quite noisy so probably everything heard us coming but it was good to kind of tick off going on a jungle track like we were definitely very much in the wilderness so that was really cool. It really felt completely away. You couldn't hear any traffic or any kind of uh, civilization or anything. It was quite tiring though, so we were quite, quite glad to come back and have lunch and have a little bit of a rest. But I think now we're going to be heading back to Sandakan where we're going to spend the next couple of days. And seeing as you kind of already saw us come in on the way, we won't bore you with the journey home. So we'll see you in the next video when we're back in Sandakan and exploring the local area. Yeah.